Continuing on with the competition, this next battle will be three two-minute rounds in the schoolgirl division. Making her way to the cage out of the blue corner, Layla Witzerman. Layla Witzerman is 14 years old and she's fighting out of Six Blades Jiu Jitsu. I sat down with Layla in the back and speaking of getting them started young, she started when she was four or five years old wow. doing martial arts. She's been doing this for a long time. <laughs> and, and she told me that um, there is something specific she would like to do with this fight. She wants to keep it standing. Okay. She likes kickboxing. This is what she told me. Um, this is the fighter who told me that her dream fight would be Carla Esparza. I see, I see. Ooh, she's ready to go. Yeah. Yeah, she was getting her hair braided when I was asking her questions. I love hearing fighters, I love asking them, what's your plan for today? Because I love being able to see it be executed. Uh -huh. you know, if I know what their plan is, and, they, and then also seeing how they adjust to when they can't execute it. Yes. Either, you know? So that's awesome. So she wants to stand in bed. Yes. All right. Layla like also that. wants yeah. to say hi to her sister, Maylani, who is competing in a jujitsu tournament in Del Mar next weekend. Okay, okay. Can't knock that. Sister Lee Love, I like that. I did that. Ready to go. Oh, and she says she knows her opponent. Okay. They know each other. They know each other. Uh -huh. That makes it even more fun. Yeah, right? that they've like... seen each other fight at these events before and all of that, yeah. <laughs> Walked across each other on the way to the locker room a couple times, looked at each other. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, what's up, girl? right now is Jaden Patches Murillo. She's 13 years old and she's fighting out of Riverside Submission. And as Tina said earlier, she knows her opponent. It looks like Jaden is from the same gym as Aaliyah from the first fight. That's right, that's right. I'm curious to see if she has the same um, or a similar submission game off her back. Oh, that would be interesting <laughs> to see, right? Oh, it would she make might. sense fighting out of Riverside Submission, right? Yes. And that might be why Layla wants to keep it standing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is for the 104 pound uh, cut weight VFC title. So oh, this yeah. is for the VFC title and it's a 104 pound uh, catch weight. So Let's go. I, I saw Jaden earlier at the way into sporting and she just had like an energy three, about her that stood out. She's been game like uh -huh. she could have probably fought this morning when she showed up. Same energy when she came out right now. Always ready. Introducing Always first, ready. <laughs> fighting out of the blue it's, corner. It's a state of mind. Yeah, this is just her, you know, her persona. I don't want to say her attitude because it seemed like she didn't Here break that all day. Layla Definitely not a character Lil thing. It's her, Mamba for sure. Witzerman. Lil Mamba. Ooh. And her opponent across the cage fighting out of the red corner. She is 13 years old and representing Riverside Submission. Here is... Jaden Patches Murillo! You referee so, in charge of the action, Vanessa Hardy. Jaden in the red corner is wearing the shorts with no pants, and then we have um, Layla wearing the shorts with pants in the blue corner. Thanks for the kick right off the glove touch. Oh, these are some aggressive punches from go, both ladies. Go. After Lots of hooks kick. from Jaden. Oh, really ripping them here. The volume is great so far. Oh, interesting. And Layla with the slam. <laughs> 
So, Layla took her down. I mean, <laughs> I mean, the volume on the feet was good, nonstop. I don't think either of them stopped I would probably went for the takedown, too. Jane is slowly creeping up that guard to a high guard position. Great technique with the kick, with the takedown. Took her down right off the kick. That's it right there. Um, Jaden is looking for the armbar. Oh, that's a great pass. Layla passes but right there. She's trying to Oh, she's got her Almost guard there, back. almost there. Wow. Wow, the settling in from half the guard. Very it looks like she's working great the work one-handed guillotine with the chin strap while still defending. Layla's trying to pass. Interesting decision to stand up from Layla. Yeah, this must be hard for her not being able to hit her in the face. I was gonna say that has to. I was watching the volume earlier, and that has to be hard for both. You know, yeah. To just continually throw to the body like that when the face is just wide open. Oh, snap. Nice pass. Wow, good job. Pass. I was just going to say, Jaden's doing a good job of, like, isolating uh, from the bottom a limb, right? So, like, she was working for the ankle before. And, uh, oh, see, even here, working for a buggy choke from side control. Look at this. What do you see? She's I was like, going to say, she's very versatile. She's, uh -huh. She never stops working. Attacking. Always attacking. Wow. What an Man. interesting round. What an interesting That's a hard match. round to, uh, to yeah. give to either fighter, you know? Very similar to Aaliyah's fight. How many times do you think you have seen in the USFL with these young fighters somebody attempt a buggy choke? Uh -huh. I, I was thinking that when she threw that up. I was like, oh, wow, going for a buggy choke. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and it's interesting. It's kind of like what, what I said at the beginning of the fight, how uh, uh, Layla said she wanted to keep it standing. Right. And, and she then realized, she takes her down. Oh, no. I'm right. going to have to take her down. Exactly. That's great. I mean, that, that, but that's good. But she has it all. Yeah, exactly. And that shows her willingness to, to acknowledge. Yeah, and, and Layla also has a puppy in her corner giving her advice. <laughs> <laughs> the cutest corner man alive. <laughs> I'm so interested to see where the second round goes. Yes, yeah, so top control from Layla in the first round, and then sub attempt from Jaden in the first round. So let's see how round two goes. Let's go, ladies. Good kick, Layla. Left hand pick up the good kicks. Oh, I love that combo. Inside, outside, follow up with the push kick for the distance. Ooh. Oh, oh, Layla with the trip. Oh, my God. Great work from I Layla. love that technique, catching the right kick and just tripping up. Wow. Second, that's how she got the first take down. And Jaden with the high guard again. Let's see how many sub attempts she throws up and how many Layla can defend today. Let's see. And you can see how Jaden was shoving her shoulder down, really trying to get that high guard up, her legs up by her opponent's shoulders. I can just see that Jaden, you know, she's very Layla's comfortable gonna use it to pass again. She got her knee on her thigh. Oh, okay. So Jaden's up. And Jaden takes Layla's full advantage of being able to get it. Layla's got a circle out. Oh, and she caught it again. Oh. oh. But she oh, loves she the ground too. That time. A lot of willingness to pull guard in these um, younger, younger girls' fights. Oh, here comes the triangle. She's working. She's got control of the head. Okay, she's oh, got to posture up. Going. Layla and has to posture up. In. It's looking. Okay, she doesn't quite closer have it closer. yet she's because of the positioning of her legs. She still has her Layla's got her elbow. Yeah, her arm is not across. Yeah, her left arm is still in. I don't know how how effective. Well, Layla's is got be. her right arm kind of blocking the hips over there. She's blocking. So now she's pushing against her body and then wedging her arm yeah. between. Her, see right there. So the pressure's not really there. Good the defense from Layla. Jada's not going out there. She's still working it, and, you know. Lila's got to get her head up. What I would like to see from Jaden is to switch her hips and take that arm bar. I think that's what our team arm. is calling for over here. She I think she's going to survive the round. Yeah, because yeah, Jaden's legs are dropping. Good work, ladies. Wow, those corners were fired up. Yeah. <laughs> what a position. What a position to Jayden be in. Really, she really wanted that triangle. And you know what? 
her her teammate came back with a triangle win. Uh -huh, so I uh -huh. wonder if that has I almost to do with I almost said it. <laughs> because again, the ref was in between me and the triangle, so I couldn't see it. Yeah. But I just let it roll. Good. So I think that Jaden has confidence in those positions off her back. That one was a little bit, it was just a little off because she was doing a good job pulling Layla's head down, but her legs weren't exactly where they needed to be to lock it in to finish it. But she did control her. Very, very good control. She was working for it the whole time. If she could have just hit that angle and got her calf across the neck, it would have been great. Yeah, I thought that it wasn't good. I also noticed Leto's left left hand was still in there, and it, she was kind of defending off the hip with that left hand. Very good defense uh, from Layla. Her framework is great, you know, with her forearm and her elbow, and just finding out the pressure. Once again, Layla's in the long pants, and Jaden is in the short side. You can definitely hear the shots landing. Yeah. I'd like to see uh, Layla sit down on her punches a little bit more, because you notice that Jaden, Jaden really rips on her. She brings her hips into those punches, you know? <laughs> oh. Nice catch. Okay, so the tables have turned. Oh boy. She needs Good to job keeping up. her head up so oh, far. She needs to posture up. It, it looks like from this position. She's in trouble here. She needs to Jaden. She's posturing up. What's her head look like over there? It looked like Jaden was one of my favorite It looks like Jaden's caught the kick setting up Kamara. Either punch or post it to the chest oh, at the but same she has time. Her head that was a great take that's, a, that's a really technical. Good job from down. Layla getting that head out. Going right into a triangle attempt, though, from Jaden. Oh, oh she has like it locked in better this time. Great can't see it Let's here. see if Layla has time to. Uh, she can kill the time and survive until the end of the round. You know, because Layla, I don't know that she's gonna be able to get out of this before the end of the round. Layla does have her stats. Because the cage is in the way too. If she wanted to flip or something to relieve the pressure, she couldn't really do it because that cage is there. Well, the thing is she's got her folded over. She's, she's doing a really good job stacking and Stacking, yeah, stacking, stacking to shut down the, the, the submission attempt. There you go. Oh, great work by Layla. Way to get good out job. of there. Working for the pass. Ooh, nice wow. body shots. See what I mean about Jaden grabbing the legs for the sweep? She yeah. is on the bottom though getting hit. <laughs> Good guard work. Wow. Good passing. She passed Let's one way, go. went the other way. Yeah. Great work. Oh my She's goodness. Another this. sub attempt. She is re they are relentless, both of them. <laughs> Look at this. Trial from the bottom. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh boy. Oh, does she have the triangle? Oh man. Wow, great work, wow, ladies. This is so cool. I can't believe I was, it. That I'm was sorry. for a title. I was thinking yeah. the exact same thing. I'm like, that wow, watching these girls, just all the tricks they have and all the go to's they have. You know, you, a lot of times you see older amateurs in there and they're really just, you can tell they're thinking of what to do. These girls are so and going from one thing to the other. Like you said, she was always holding on to her ankles, always looking for that sweep to break her guard and then push on her hips, get the trip. Yeah, very, very Layla tough. kept trying to settle, but she was never safe because Jaden was always attacking from the bottom. How exciting. Yeah, you know, Layla, I, I don't know if you caught it, but right before she got taken down, she threw a kick and she almost hit her in the head and she like made her like, oh, uh -huh, sorry, uh -huh, like, yeah, an to, accident. You know, Great work from both fighters. Yeah, Layla was also wiping her nose. I don't know if she accidentally got hit in the nose. I personally have a nose that decides to bleed even if you just look at it. So <laughs> maybe she's dealing with some of that too. Aw, her corner is so proud. Wow, that was so exciting. As a spectator, I, I would like two more rounds, please. <laughs> I, I was thinking the same thing right when the third round ended. I was I like, know, wow, I know. It's girls over girls. already. Yeah. And, and, and how do you even score that? You know? I know. Man. Good thing I'm not a judge. I mean, at this point, you got to think like maybe they turn the tides a little bit. They bring the, maybe the, oh, they're wearing headgear. So, you know, not close to this. Maybe the, the real paint race, open, open, open hand in the face. Just to change up the dynamic a little bit, help them build their combos. Because it seems like they have to stand right there on the center line. I know. And just throw to the body I line. know. I was thinking that too. Especially in the first round when they were tied up and throwing those body shots like that over and over and over. If they, could, if they were just allowed maybe one or two more tools. You know, I'm not saying, you know, lose the headgear. Let him close this, you know, but hey, maybe some open hands could really change the dynamic. 
Well, you know, I asked Layla if she's excited to turn 18 so she can throw shots to the head, and she said, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for these two warriors. After three rounds, we head to the judges' scorecard for decision. Judge Gordon Hour scores the contest as a draw. And Judge Beeman and Judge Paulson score the contest for your winner by majority decision. Out of the blue corner, Layla Lil Mamba. Wow. And your new Look at this. girl Layla championship. Layla prioritized uh, you know thanking her opponent and showing love to her opponent over getting the belt around her waist. You know what I mean? Like that's such great sports. This first friendship. What you know, wanted to let her know she did a good job instead of going straight to the belt. And a lot of times you don't see that. <laughs> that belt gets stolen right up in the air, opponent disappears under the back, never to be seen again. <laughs> All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, three fights down. Now we're going into the fourth bout of our USFL portion of Valkyrie fighting. Great fight so far. Having a great time here. 